Good day class! Today we are going to learn the different types of sorting raw materials. Learning competency. Prepare the raw materials and sort raw materials in accordance with specifications. In today's lesson, we will define sorting and identify and describe the types of sorting of raw materials. Hi students! How is everyone doing? Let's start! What comes on your mind when you hear the word sorting? What is sorting? Sorting and screening dry and wet are the separation of raw materials and food slurries into categories based on shape, size, weight, image, and color. Sorting also allows the separation at first sight of some undesirable additional materials, example, leaves and stones, or inappropriate raw materials like immature or rotted berries, and is aimed at ensuring preserving only good quality fruit is passed through the further processing. There are three types of sorting raw materials. We have size sorting, shape sorting, and color sorting. So we will start with size sorting. The size sorting is especially important for food products which must be heated or cooled as large differences in size might lead to an over-processing or under-processing of the product. The size sorting and dry cleaning of agricultural raw materials separate solids into two or more fractions based on different sizes, usually by sieving or screening. For size sorting, various types of screens and sieve with fixed or variable apertures can be used. The screen may be stationary, rotating, or vibrating. Next, we have the shape sorting. Shape sorting can be accomplished manually or mechanically with, example, a belt or roller sorter. Weight sorting is a very accurate method and is therefore used for more valuable foods like for example, cut meats, eggs, tropical fruits, and certain vegetables. Image processing is used to sort foods based on length, diameter, and appearance. Example, surface defects and orientation of food on a conveyor. And lastly, we have color sorting. Color sorting can be applied at high rates using microprocessor controlled color sorters. Let's practice.
Number one, define sorting. Sorting and screening are the separation of raw materials and food slurries into categories based on shape, size, weight, image, and color. Number two, identify the following pictures as to what types of sorting raw materials. Right shape, color, or size of sorting inside the box. Number one, what type of sorting is this? Color sorting. Correct. Number two, what type of sorting is this? Shape sorting, correct. Number three, what type of sorting is this? Size sorting, very good. Congratulations! Job well done! Remember, Sorting during the material preparation process involved placing, produced in two categories based on specifications or standards to be met. For example, foods may be processed based in differences in physical properties such as color, texture, size, shape, and weight. For example, pumpkins for the fresh market should preferably be of uniform shape, weight, and size for packing. Those that have an irregular shape or are too big or too small can be diverted for cooking and pulping for use in value-added products such as pies and or dehydrated and added to soups. Separation may also be done based on chemical composition such as bricks or sugar content. Juice processors, for example, will want fruits that have high sweetness with an acceptable balance in acidity. In flour milling, flour is sorted into different streams and packages based on bran and protein content. Okay, so let's check what have you learned today. Let's try directions. Supply with correct types of sorting raw materials given the description below. Right size, shape, or color of sorting. Number one, it can be applied at high rates using microprocessor controlled color sorter. What do you think is the answer? Size sorting, color sorting, or shape sorting.
Number two, it also allows the separation at first sight of some undesirable additional materials. What do you think is the answer? Number three, it is used to sort foods based on length, diameter, and appearance. What do you think is the answer? Number four, this type of sorting uses various types of screens and sieves with fixed or variable apertures can be used. And number five, this type of sorting can be accomplished manually or mechanically. What do you think is the answer? Congratulations! Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell button to be updated. Thank you. See ya on my next videos.